Hey guys, I'm going to be doing a look of the day today. So today is my little brother's birthday. So I remember a year ago I actually made a video saying that it was his birthday as well and asking people to go comment on his channel. But I'm going to his birthday, to his house today for his birthday. So for my eyeshadow today, I just did a blue, black, smoky eye with lashes. So I'll, sh so I'll show you exactly what I used. So for my... For the inner corner of my eye, I just have a shimmery white. I use my Coastal Scents palette and I use the first one, the lightest one. So I use that for my inner corners. For the blue that I used, I just used one blue. I used my Wales palette, my favorite blue, this teal right there. I need to find like a dupe for that color because you can't buy this palette anymore. Like I don't even think they make it, so I don't like showing it in all my look of the days, but I I have it on hand all the time, so I use it. <laughs> so for the black, I use my NYX Trio in white, gray, and black. The black color. For my highlight, I used NYX in highlight. Uh, for my eyebrows, I used this this nude taupe and dark brown. So I actually bought another one of these. It's coming. So uh, me and Astro Zombie, we made a huge um, like purchase on CherryCulture.com. A whole a huge NYX haul that's coming, and like NYX is having their dollar twenty sale now. They're gonna be having that I think starting Friday. That everything on their site is going to be a dollar twenty, except for like the brushes and the the train cases, and it's just like it's really depressing because we just like bought so much stuff, and it's like we could have gotten it from the Nick site. So when the sale comes, I'm gonna check it out. But we pretty much got everything we needed on the chair culture site, so we'll check it out. I doubt we're gonna get anything, but whatever. Also, um, for my primer, I use the Urban K Primer Potion. So this is the old model. So after like years of everyone bitching about the packaging, I remember on like MySpace makeup groups, we were still talking about the packaging and how much it sucks. Because they have it like this. They finally made a squeeze tube. I saw it at Sephora and I was so excited. Like I was like, oh my god, they finally made a squeeze tube. Because we've been like talking about that for years that they should make this into a, into a squeeze tube. To get everything out of this, you have to actually like remove the little stopper to get the more, and then, there, then you have to like cut it open and get like everything out, which sucks. So I'm so glad they made a squeeze tube. Um, for my pencil liner on the inside, I use this Rimmel Black Magic. For my top liner, I use Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in Trooper. The lashes I used today, if you can tell, I wore lashes today, were these Taiwan lashes I got from like eBay. So this whole thing cost me like two bucks, like with shipping. I think it's awesome deal, awesome deal. Awesome lashes, I love it all. Alright, so for blush today I wore my L'Oreal True Match blush in Baby Blossom. Baby Blossom. And the lip gloss I wore today, I wore this vinyl gloss, this Rimmel vinyl gloss. So this used to be clear. Um, I put it over uh, MAC Myth so many times that it turned this ugly nude color. But I wanted like a nude lip today, but I didn't want to wear any nude lipstick because I didn't want it to be like too overpowering. So I just wore this lip gloss. So on my nails, um, on my nails I have China Glaze for Aubrey. So I have this on all of my nails and then on my ring fingers I just have the China Glaze Black Crackle in Black Mesh. So I actually just got this yesterday. So I really like it. I have three crackles now from China Glaze and I'm really excited with them. I haven't tried the OPI ones or like the Katy Perry ones, so I don't understand how crackles can be like so different. So I'd like to try them out, see how they are. 
Um, so that is my look of the day. Oh, my look. Yes, my look of the day. Alright, thanks guys. Bye. Alright, so I filmed my look of the day, but I also uh, was going to do my birch box that I received in my birch box, but I forgot. So, um, I received my birch box yesterday. So, follow me on Twitter. You know how I was very annoyed about it. I was very unhappy with my birch box. So, this is the first one I've ever gotten. I paid 10 bucks for it like a month and a half ago when I got it. Okay? Got it yesterday. And they sent me like the card, blah, 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 mother's, grandmother's, like a Mother's Day box, whatever. And I thought being the first birch box, they were going to at least do a little something extra to get me to be like, oh, wow, this is awesome. I'm going to keep paying and subscribing and getting this thing. But no, I'll tell you exactly what it came with. came with um, a luminizing moisture tint. What is this? Like foundation, like two little packets of foundation. I think my hair is totally in the way. They sent me um, a little card telling me that I can make custom cards. They sent me this little shampoo, which is like one wash. I think that's the point of one wash. Look at this lip gloss. A lip gloss. Look at this compared to like a nail polish. Like this thing is tiny. How many ounces is this? This is like 0 0.06, so 2 milliliters. And this is 6 milliliters. So, this is tiny. This is like 4 applications. They sent me a pomegranate soap, which I've already tried and it is so drying. Oh my god, it is drying. It's a little less soap. It gives a good lather, but like every time I use it, I have to put on like lotion afterwards because it's so drying. They sent me a mud mask. So this is the only thing that I was like okay with, that I liked. So so they sent me a shampoo, a lip gloss, a soap, and a mud mask. And oh yeah, a little packet of foundation. So um, that was 10 bucks of stuff from Birchbox. So I'm pretty unhappy with my Birchbox. Uh, they, they, I read somewhere on the site that you can like return it. So if I can return it, I will because this stuff is stupid. 10 bucks for that. Like I really could have gotten so, many, so much like better stuff for 10 bucks. So I'm going to be emailing them seeing what I can do if I can send it back. And I better be able to cancel. I don't think I signed up for like a year contract or anything like that so I better be able to cancel. <sighs> I'm not happy with my birch box. So um I don't know if I'll wait another month. I'll see. I'll email them and see what's up. But I just want to include that. How was a stupid birch box. And that's all. Alright thanks guys. Bye.